Nightfighthike.com here with Bozy Ennis. How you doing today, brother? Good, brother. How you feel? Ah, uh, no complaints at all, man. You know, about a week and a half or so till the fight. How you feeling? Did you, like, break down tape of him? Because Jerron said he ain't really look at him at all. I don't look at tapes. Okay, so... My sons didn't probably look at I don't look at tapes. Gotcha. Uh, what I do when, when, when we first get the ring, that first round, when he come back to the corner, that's why I dissect him. Mm. I dissect him like that. Everybody asks me, I never watch people up in tapes of fighters. Is it, because is, is it, a lot of times you you preparing for that one fighter, and always sometimes the fighter get hurt, and then you are fighting a different uh, a different fighter. So yeah. you prepare for a different type of fighter. In your honest opinion, do you think that you know if you guys win that entry title, do you think Spence is gonna say, okay, I'm gonna fight him now, or do you think he's gonna just move up? You never know with Spence because Spence is not scared. Like I tell people, he's not scared. It's just it's business, man. You know what I mean? Boost is high risk, low reward. They, people who understand that. And like I said to, to uh, the other uh, guy who was reporting stuff, I told him the same thing. I said, man, no fighter is scared of another fighter, man. You know what I mean? It's just business move. Just like say, like you say, Rashidi Elvis coming up mm -hmm. and Boost coming at the same time. Why would they fight now? Mm -hmm. Until they get to where, where they trying to get to. They on yeah. the same lane. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? He just on the other side and Boost on this side. Gotcha. Wait till you get to the top. And then we fight, we fighting for something, yeah. Gotcha. We both, we both, both can fight, and both can box, you know what I mean? Because I've talked to him already, you know what I mean? He's a good fighter, I don't care what nobody said. I'm mm -hmm. gonna box his ass off, yeah, for sure. you know what I mean? What do you think about the pretty big fight against um, Imantius Daniones versus Virgil T. Jr.? It's supposed to happen sometime next year. Who are you giving the edge to in that, man? That's tough. I understand this, that's what Gray say. It's a tough fighter because they both fight similar to the same. Yeah. And they come right into you. And you you have to sway with I had to sway with what you call him a little bit because he's a uh, he's a puncher. Virgil. Virgil Ortiz. Mm -hmm. He's a puncher. And they doing the same thing. You know, they coming in, they fighting. In. It's gonna be a war though. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be a war from the beginning. But if I had bet my money, I'd put my money on Virgil Ortiz. Gotcha. Now you know Virgil Ortiz, your son. A lot of back and forth between like media members and yeah, fans. Yeah. They really want to see that fight. Yeah. Do you view that fight as the next? Um, Mayweather versus Pacquiao, I do. Spence versus Crawford. I do, I do, because the way the way the way they building him, the way they moving him, and they doing they doing the right a uh, good job. People think he's nothing. He's not that, that guy. Ain't scared of Boots. Just like Boots call all them out, and, and people people understand Boots call everybody out because we want to test ourselves, man. In order to be uh, order to be great, we got to see where we are coming from with with the best in the division. You know what I mean? You know, also, again, in your honest opinion, we've been waiting for it forever. Thought we were going to get it this year. Right. Do you think we're going to finally get Spence versus Crawford, or you think Spence is just going to say, forget it, move up, and then just leave it alone, man? But you said you think Spence and Crawford going to fight? Yeah, eventually. Well, next year. I, I think it's going to happen, man. Okay. I think it's going to happen, man. I think it's going to happen. Because Spence really went to fight. Yeah. I know he really went to fight. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And, and the stuff that uh, Crawford has just done, you know what I mean? I would never done that. You know what I mean? Did you watch the fight, man? Yeah, I watched it. Were you impressed at all by what he did out there? Or? No, he was supposed to do that. That guy, that guy was nowhere in his lead, man. You could be him. <laughs> you know what I mean? Give me a few months of training. I'm coming down to the yeah, dungeon. Yeah, man. man. I'm telling you. No, for real, man. You know, he just coming in like this and, you know what I mean? And you see how he was throwing the punches. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You know, one thing about Crawford, he might start off slow, but he gets smarter and smarter as the rounds go on. Do you consider Crawford as the best fighter pound for pound right now? Because he keeps saying it. ESPN has him number one. Do you think he is? No, I think uh, I, I, right now, I think Spence is. Spence is number the, one The reason fighter? why I said he's number one because he got, he got three of the belts. Mm. That's why I so, said So he, you think he's the best fighter in the world, though? In the world? Like pound, pound for pound. pound? pound? Yeah. In the world. Who else did y'all see pound for pound? NUA, Usyk. In the way is good. See, yeah, it, I mean, he's some good guys, man. Mm. You know what I mean? But in, in the other well, way, I say Spence. Mm. That's what I say. Spence is the, the, the best right now, you know, is, is, pound for pound. I say because he look who he with to, to get to where he at though. He went to some top guys. Would you say that's the reason why you guys kind of said uh, maybe we're not gonna go to WBO? Even though I think you guys were like ranked number two, you're going to IBF route because you could get Spence, you get those three titles. Right, right. Is that the reason why? No, no, no. We we. If they gave us an opportunity to fight for the WBO, we'd take that too. Mm. We, you know what I mean? We just want to get, we want to get all the titles. You know what I mean? And after we get all the titles, then we want to move up to 154. 
Well, you know, last question for you, man. Because, um, you know, Jerron, was always, he's always been saying he wants to get all the titles. But yeah, yeah. if you look at Crawford, you look at Spence, yeah. they've been trying to get all the titles for like the past five, six I know. years. I know. You know, Jerron's 25. Yeah. You know, it, it could be hard for him to get all the titles at 47. Because he's so young. Yeah. Do you, do you kind of – do you guys kind of think like, well, maybe we could go to 54 and fight Jamel? I know he's a bigger guy. He's a great fighter. Right, he but is. he has all of the titles. You know what I oh, mean? Yeah, so, that's, and that, that's, that's, that sounds good. Great, man. You just, you just threw something at me. It sounds really great. Do you think that's a possibility for you guys? Or oh, is it yeah. just like... You, well, see, you never, you never can tell. We, we got to find out which way all this stuff going to turn out. You know what I mean? You know? Do you consider, do you consider Jamel a better fighter than, than Errol Spence? Man, they both great fighters, man. I can't see. But, but they, they got different styles, though. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And they both great fighters. So I don't, I'm not going to say he's better than him. I know uh, uh, Jamal, what's Jamal, right? Jamal. Jamal. Mm -hmm. Jamal is, is uh, I know he's bigger and he's stronger. Mm -hmm. But uh, when it comes to their styles, they got different type of styles. But I don't know, man, about that. I know they've been sparring together, and I heard you about the sparring and all that. Yeah. But you got them little eight ounce gloves on, man. It's a different situation, man. So, right. so I can't, I can't really say, man. I, I like both of them guys, man. You know what I mean? I don't say nothing bad about none of them fighters because I like fighters. Gotcha. You know what I mean? Thank you, brother. Yeah. Appreciate you. Anytime, man.